name is Rose. Hope you guys are having a great day. So today's video is this makeup look today. I just wanted to like throw in a red lip. I feel like I haven't done it in a little while. I was like, girl, you need to do it, okay? It's, 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 it's today is the day. I'm using a lot of new products, mostly drugstore slash affordable products in today's video. So if you want to know how I created this look from start to finish, well, just, just stay seated and don't touch anything. Let's begin. So this is the foundation I'm wearing. If you want to see my whole thoughts on it, make sure you definitely go check out that video. It will be linked right here. So go check it out. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and jump into the eyes. All right, my friends. I'm starting with no eye makeup. I'm going to be using Makeup Geeks Morocco, okay? I'm dipping into the shadow, and I'm going to be applying this at the outer corner and the inner corner of my eye. We're going to be creating a halo eye for today's look which is super easy and actually very quick. Y'all will see it, okay? It does not take a lot of time, I promise you. So I'm gonna make sure this is just very blended out. There's smooth, it's just smooth. There's no harsh lines. Then after I do that, I'm dipping into Makeup Geek's Mocha, which is just a dark brown. We're just applying this right on top of that orange. And one of the main keys to this look is taking the time to blend it out. So I'm going back in with a larger fluffy brush, eyeshadow brush. And I'm just applying this with a little bit of that orange. I'm going to be using ColourPop's Cannoli Trio, okay? And these are a bunch of different highlighters. I'm going to be using the color in Whipped and applying this with a flat top brush onto the lid area of my eyes. You can also use your hand. I feel like with some ColourPop eyeshadows, it's just much better to use your hand to apply them, especially if you're applying it to the lid of the eye. They just come out much more pigmented and just beautiful. I'm going to go back in with Makeup Geeks Morocco and I'm using a nice large fluffy brush again. I'm just applying this at the outer core of the eye then taking it into that crease area just to blend all the shades of different colors together. Lastly, I'm going to be popping on some lashes. These are black up lashes. I never knew black up cosmetics had lashes but definitely love them. I've actually been wearing them for the past two to three weeks so I do like them. I do, I do, I must say. I quickly went ahead and cleaned up my brows with some concealer. If you want to see my full brow routine, I will link it down below. I'm going to go ahead and move back to the eye. I'm going to smoke out the lower lash line of my eyes with that same orange eyeshadow in Morocco. And I'm using a very pointed eyeshadow brush because it's just going to get right under that eye and really smoke it out. I'm also going to pop on some mascara, then to highlight the eye, I love doing this, especially in the summer. I'm going to be using this LA Girl White Eyeliner, and I'm popping this right on my lower waterline of my eyes. It's just going to make your eyes pop and just really look brightened and awake. Alright guys, so my eyes are done very bright, very popping. I'm going to go on to blush, so I'm going to be using the Black Radiance toasted almond blush and I'm just gonna swirl this brush this is from kiss if you're wondering ruby kisses and just apply this to my cheeks just to add a touch of color to the cheeks 
Then I'm also going to highlight, which you guys, I never do anymore because I feel like highlighting is not the best for my skin. But for this look, we're going to highlight because we want it to be highlighted. We're wearing a red lip, we want it to pop, so we're going to do that, okay? So, if you don't like to highlight like me, you don't have to, but we're going to do it just for this look. Also, I do want to use the ColourPop Highlighting Trio. Um, I want to use as much as I can, so I'm going to use both of these colors, which is Wisps and Frosted, together. And you guys can see, they're pretty much gold shades. Like, this is probably a bit more lighter, and this is a bit more darker gold, but they're pretty much both gold. <laughs> Mmm, hello, whoa, whoa, very pigmented. I'm also going to take a little bit on my forehead area just to kind of give that all over highlight look. So lastly for my lips, I'm going to be using this Maybelline lip color and this is in Red Revival. Alright guys, so this is the final look today. I hope you guys enjoy this look from start to finish. Let me know what you want to see next down below. Make sure you subscribe down below to see more of my videos. I love you and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.